Hi, this is Mike Fauche, a.k.a. PC Doc. Um, I'd like to kind of cover creating storage spaces, volumes, in Server 8. I uh, covered prior in an earlier video how to create it in Windows 8, but in Server 8 it's a little bit different. Um, I'm going to walk you through how to do it. Um, the one thing I've already noticed prior to starting is that if you have a dedicated controller card um, or an external controller card in your system you may run into issues when I had some drives attached to a high point card in a non ray configuration it would only detect one of the drives so there may be some some compatibility issues at this point but on the native motherboard controller it seems to work fine so let's walk through it a little bit and uh, I may stumble a little bit on this one because it's relatively new to me um, looking at the server dashboard right now and um, I'm going right. to go ahead and click on in storage and here you get a list of your servers I'm going to go ahead and click on storage pools and here it shows me um, the uh, basically all the available volumes together as one total storage pool and then it shows me the physical drives at the bottom um, this is unallocated storage not necessarily that they've been created in the pool already it's a default unallocated storage so first thing I'm going to do is going to go ahead and right click and click on new storage pool and it walks you through a wizard so let's hit next and I'm going to go ahead and give it a name here. I'm going to say something very creative. I'm going to go ahead and click Next. Um, here's where you get a list of your physical drives. And again, um, while these exact drives were attached to a high point controller card, I was not able to see two of the three drives, only saw one of the drives. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and click all the drives. Click next. And here it's asking me for confirmation. And I'm going to go ahead and create. And it's now completed the storage pool. So now, again, you can see my storage pool here. It's now listed as a storage pool. It's no longer unallocated. And you can see the total amount of available space um, as it tag teamed all of these drives together. All right, the next step is to go ahead and create virtual disks for the server. So I'm going to go ahead and launch the wizard and click Next. Um, again, here's my stats from the prior setup of the... Uh, storage pool I'm going to give it a clever name like VHD test hit next and again here it gives me a choice of simple for a stripe configuration a mirror for redundancy and parity which is equivalent to a RAID 5 configuration. So I'm going to go ahead and click Parity to stay consistent with the other testing I'm doing. So I'm going to hit Next. It's telling me um, uh, fixed. So I'm going to use the exact, um, use the space from the storage pool equivalent to the volume size. And here I'm going to create a 3 terabyte. So here's the total, here's the uh, results, kind of a summary of what's gonna, what the process is. I'm going to go ahead and click create, and it's go ahead, and it's creating the actual drive. It says it's finished. Okay, so now I have a listing of everything that I have. Um, as you can see, the uh, allocation space is now down to only 978 gigabytes free space. Um, I now have allocated three terabytes for a parity. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and right click on that, click new volume, click next, and click next. 
and I'm gonna say go ahead and use the all three terabytes. I'm gonna give it a letter G. Click next. And here is where I can default the file system to either NTFS or the new REFS. So just for experimental purposes, I'm going to go ahead and use REFS. And I'm going to go ahead and call it as the volume. Click next. And I'm going to go ahead and hit create. And again, it walks through, does the format, it's completed, hit close, and I should now be able to go to my computer, and there is my volume, which should be a RAID 5 parity drive through storage spaces virtual drive. Okay, hope that you enjoyed the video. Thank you very much.